Hi. I think I'm live. I haven't been live in so long and I'm so nervous. Let me just see that I'm in the right spot. I am. I am here. I am Selena Morali and I'm here on my Sleepy Owl Co. business page. And hold on a second. That's too big. I can't see comments if I am like this. Hey. Okay. There we go. Now I can see comments. So I haven't been live in a long time. Hi, Beth. Okay, good. I'm in the right place. So I haven't been um, live in a long time and uh, I don't know why. <laughs> I've just been really busy. Hi, Natalie. Hi, Robin. Um, but today is a big day for me because uh, Friends is my most favorite TV show of all time. And I really wanted to make a few cards. Hey, Marcy. Hey, Joy. I wanted to make a few cards um, that pay homage or tribute to my favorite show. I am in my friend's attire here. I'll stand up. I even have friend's pants. Can you see? They're pajama pants. Um, I'm in it. Oh, and look, I also have my token mug. But I'm not drinking coffee now because I won't sleep. I can't drink coffee after 2 p.m. So in here is water, but later I'm going to move on to some Pinot Grigio while I watch Friends in silence, hopefully. Hopefully the kids will be asleep. So I wanted to come on live and show you a few things that, um, just a quick little session because I know many of you wanna watch it too, um, if you haven't already. But if you have, no spoilers, please don't tell me anything except if you enjoyed it, okay? So I am going to uh, flip my camera. Let's see if I can do it this way. Oh, I'm upside down. <laughs> okay, let's see if this does the job. We're down to my desk. Is this right? Oh, I don't know, because there's a delay. Oh, look, yeah, that's me. Here we go. We are... Facing the right way, perfect. Okay, you're watching it right now, Don. Oh my gosh, pause it, pause it. So <laughs> here's a little card that I just literally used my stamp and write markers to make and tried to copy the font, um, the friend's font, and it's a fail. I don't love it, so there it goes, <laughs> it's gone. Okay, so let me start by telling you I have um, many, many favorite episodes and one of them is the pivot episode so that's the one where Ross gets a new couch and Ross and Rachel need to lift the couch into um, Ross's apartment and the stairs are very very narrow and the way he says pivot like cracks me up I can watch it 100 times and I will still crack up every time so this is my card I <laughs> found the perfect brown cinnamon cider and my lighting is terrible. Oh, let me see if I can fix my lighting. One second. Is that better? Let's see. Or is it darker? I don't know. Oh, well, you can see. So here you see my lovely daughter, Kiana, who finds everything online and teaches me a lot of things, found the Friends font. And I asked her to print some um, some things for me. So this is my favorite episode. This is a cinnamon cider couch. And I used some of our, our stitched rectangle dies. And I cut out the pillows. And then I just basically fussy cut these pillows. And used my rectangular stitch die to cut out this um, pivot sign. So I love it. Um, my favorite episode seriously yes Dawn it's Crave TV on demand um, or HBO Max I don't think in Canada we get HBO Max so it's Crave here in Canada so hopefully you can catch it um, the next card who here remembers smelly cat smelly cat no I'm not gonna say what are they feeding you um, so Phoebe sings a smelly cat song and here's my little take on that 
song or episode. Um, we have the Pampered Pets stamp set, and I just stamped the cute, well, the cat here, right onto my little note card, and I colored it with our Stampin' Blend, so I think I used soft, soft suede and a little bit of crumb cake. And then just with a fine tip marker, I made these little smelly squiggles and um, Kiana once again uh, printed out the smelly cat for me and that's it. It's just a very simple three by three note card and I love it. Oh, thanks Beth. <laughs> um, and then I made another three by three note card and you'll all recognize this. This is our, um, so I used Highland Heather on a gorgeous grape card base, okay? Kitchen Nazi. <laughs> There's so many, I can't pick a favorite. There's really um, just too many favorites to mention. Um, that whole season where Ross was angry, oh, kills me every time when someone ate his sandwich out of the fridge. Anyways, I could talk about this forever. But here, um, this card and the one that I'm going to make uh, tonight was inspired by um, one of my team members, Shams, and she posted a picture of a card and I'm like, I need to make a friend's card. So then I ended up making many. Um, this is this die here is the Stitched with Whimsy and this one is the Ornate Frames. Um, I think it's retired. And uh, thank you to Cheryl D'Souza, shout out to Cheryl, who um, cut some out for me and I picked them up today because I don't have the die anymore. I either sold it or I lost it. I don't know. I was like, when am I going to use this? And clearly it's perfect for the frame on the, fr on the door of uh, Rachel and Monica's apartment. So cute little card, but now we're going to make a standard size card. And I have some Smoky Slate cardstock, standard size, and I've just folded it up, um, scored it at five and a half and folded it. Then I've taken a Smoky Slate layer and I embossed it with our Brick 3D embossing folder. And let's just go ahead and stick this onto our card base. like so looks straight to me this is an older folder older folder why um, but it has carried over into the new annual catalog so that's great because it's one of my favorites then I've gone ahead I'm gonna put that aside for now I've taken a piece of gorgeous grape and I believe it is three by four and three quarters and then I took a Highland Heather layer, which is just uh, an eighth of an inch smaller. So let's go ahead and stick this on. And I messed that up, there we go. Like this. So Shams's card is quite similar. I just changed it up a bit and um, I literally fell in love with her card and I think I commented that she needs to send me one in the mail. Maybe I'll send you one of mine, Shams, and you send me yours, okay? So we got that stuck together. Then I need some help. So I have one frame that is cut out from Daffodil Delight. The other is from Crushed Curry. It's hard to tell which is the most appropriate. So in this one, I use the Crush Curry. So someone tell me, which one should I use for this one? Maybe the Daffodil Delight. I don't know, let's see. Well, I'm gonna take my combo glue um, because it probably would have made sense to cut these out with our adhesive, back, uh, adhesive sheet on the back, so I could have just peeled it, but Okay, nobody's commenting, so I'm going to have to... Oh, crushed curry. Thank you, Joy. I just needed someone to make a decision for me. <laughs> so I'm just going to dab a little bit 
I don't want to overdo it because I don't want glue marks just along the edges like so. Oh, daffodil delight, you said the split too late. <laughs> okay, let's put it right in the middle and let's just hold it down. How long is it, the reunion, for those who have watched it? Is, it? is it more than an hour? I hope so. I really hope so. Okay, I think that's stuck. And we're going to take one of our matte black dots. And we're going to put it in the center. That's our little peephole, eye hole. I don't know what it's called, peephole? That sounds wrong anyways <laughs> we're gonna put that in the middle then here is an oldie but a goldie this is our owl punch that um, retired many 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 years ago but obviously given the fact I love owls I never got rid of it and I used it to punch out some circles I'll show you which ones and I punched a little one out of our gold glimmer um, paper cardstock I think that's retired too but you know it's nice to hang on to pieces like this scraps like this for this exact purpose when I want to make a friend's card um, and then I'm gonna take one of these gems let's take and put it right in the center like so and then we need a glue dot and we're gonna stick the entire uh -oh, the entire thing right under like that okay so we're just building the pieces of our door and it looks like I may have lost some pieces <laughs> great just in time for my life how awesome Okay, so I'm gonna make the doorknob right now. And I've taken some of our gold foil and I cut a little rectangle. I punched two more, two more of these circles with my owl punch. And you'll see the owl punch also has these tiny ones here. I guess that's supposed to be the eyeball of the owl. And I just punched one out of black. And now we're going to stick this onto our door handle with some glue dots. So we're just basically doing a combination of punch art and a little bit of fussy cutting and freehand freestyle cutting, you'll see what I mean, in order to make this card. So Shams, you if you're when you watch or if you're watching the replay, yours is a lot more accurate. But I had to use what I owned, okay? So here's our doorknob or door handle, doorknob, and I'm going to stick it right about here. And it's funny, um until I was making this card, I didn't realize how many little pieces there are to this door. And when you watch the episode, it's accurate. These are all accurate parts of the door. Okay, so there's my little... Actually, I should have probably stuck this to my card base because it's going to be lumpy otherwise. So let's do that now. Just using our stamp and seal. Oh, of course, during a live, it's not working for me. There we go. Oh, come on. You're here. Okay, good. So you'll see how I makeshifted the parts where, that you so beautifully did on your card, but it does the job. And this looks like the middle, maybe a little bit more over, like so. Okay, we're getting closer. Then I just cut out a piece of 
black cardstock, our basic black, and then I did this again with our gold foil. I fussy cut a little um, lock knob. What do we call it? The lock, the slider thing. Again, very accurate and true to the show. And I'm gonna put that here, like that. Okay. And finally, the little slidey lock thingy. <laughs> I don't know the names of things, but I know what it does. And Shams, you had uh, you had actually, I think you used some sequins for the chain. I don't have any of that left, so I'm going to skip the chain in my version. And there we go. Okay, and just to add a little bit of detail, I'm gonna take my marker again and just do these squiggles. Just so that it looks like the door is not perfect. And thank you, Kiana, for printing me um, happy birthday in the Friends font. And I just cut it out using our stitched rectangle dies. And I think this I want to raise up on dimensionals. Yes, use the sequin from the Christmas one. Yeah. I know, right, Lindsay? I did not know all this detail was on the door. But I'm telling you, go Google it. Google a picture and you'll see there was this much on it. And it's one of my favorite shows. Okay, so I think three will do the job. And we're just going to put that in the bottom. It's not centered. There we go. There you go. A very cute, simple, happy birthday card. I might even save it for myself and give it to myself on my birthday. But I love it. And I love the show. And I'm so sad that it's gone. And here I'll put all of them back together in case you joined me late. I'm telling you, this was a really quick video. I just wanted to show a few things. Um, hopefully it inspires you. Hopefully it gets you, uh, reminded you to watch the show that's out today. Seriously, Smelly Cat, how cute are you? Come on. I don't know who I'd give it to, um, but maybe I'll just keep it. I'm gonna make a board, a friend's board. So here we go, these are the cards. Tell me which is your favorite. Anyone? Really short, sweet, quick video. You can tell I haven't been on in a while. And I'm trying to get off. No, just just joking. So if anyone wants um, me to send them this card, if you comment, if you have commented, great. You're, I'll put you in a draw. Shams, you're going to get one regardless. We're going to do a trade Z's. I'm going to make another one. Um, so please comment below or and I will send one to the winner. Okay, I think I have most of your addresses, and if not, I'll PM you. That's it. That's all she wrote. I hope you guys have fun watching the reunion show. Let me turn this back. Now it's going to be really dark when I turn. Oh, and I'm upside down. Ha! Ah. Hi, there. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I hope you guys have fun watching the show. I hope you are dressed for the occasion. Okay. It's not the same unless you dress for the occasion. I also have a friend's blanket, socks, everything. I even have little espresso cups, wine glasses. It's all there, okay? So make sure you enjoy. Tell me um, which cart is your favorite. <laughs> it's not your fault. I know, I'm singing it. I'm singing it all day. Um, and I will draw a winner and mail you this card, okay? That's it, guys. Have a great night. We'll talk to you soon. Bye. I'm still here because I don't know how to close it. Oh, there we go. <laughs>